Last battle. Let's go. The final encounter. Nelson has nowhere to run anymore. I hope you're ready because there's no turning back now. Thanks for the encouragement. There's a lot of vents on the sides. I mean, at the same time, why? There's no point in collecting them now. But okay. Oh, what's this? Whoa. No, okay. What? Okay. I'm not gonna complain. It's a little bit dangerous. No, 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 no. Oof. Nelson. I think I have to destroy those crystals as well. Oh wait, what the hell? Okay. Works. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Unlucky. Is this not like very much reminding of Fall Guys or whatever? Come on, give me a platform. Here we go. Ah. Okay. Oh, damn. This should be safe here.
Uh, no, I'm not gonna go far away because then the grenade will be hard to aim. <laughs> Just small movements. <laughs> oh my god, so unlucky. Oh, it changes. It's not the same. I think I'm just gonna move two tiles. That's the tactic. Yeah. <laughs> I cheated the system. Like, it aims at me, of course, but not that frequently to have to move just every step. Yeah, very convenient. Here's the platform. Get it! What? How? Oh, okay. This is I was confused. Respect. I hope the ice giant teaches him a lesson and that our paths never cross again. <laughs> what? <laughs> Well, well, he became a toy. Wait, <laughs> I need to land from this panel. <laughs> okay, uh, heroic jump. Ooh, okay, nice. As well as you can die here. Every time there's a step to just your demise. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> I guess that's it, right? What's this? Is this like a model of a person that actually was steering then? Like some concept arts? Yeah, it seems like it. Okay. Oh, it's a Polish project. I didn't even realize. Okay, so here's the thing. I'm happy that it's gonna come on quests. I'll be even more happier when there's gonna be introduced more mechanics because the graphical level and just like the overall polish is high. There are some things that I encountered in this playthrough that were unnecessary or like not worked upon. I think the direct comparison we can do is with Crash Bandicoot. And that's a good comparison, not mentioning like the copyright or whatever because no one cares. But like just making a use of collecting symbols or hieroglyphics or whatever as a currency to have some variety in just combat or just movement in general like triple jump just combos like anything you can introduce new and give a meaning to collect things not only to have like those mascots because th I'm assuming that's all to it because I just got one <laughs> because it just seems kind of irrelevant to really put your time and just collect all the things and do 100% although I'm not sure what's about with these bonus stages because it's not unlocked it was never explained to me if it's like some mods from Steam or something like community maps. I have no idea if it's actually available now or in the future, but it wasn't said in any tutorial or whatever, so I can't assume what it is. But like just introducing new stuff is gonna be fine. It's not gonna make game unbearably easy to play because there are certain ones in the game that I would love to have triple jump because even though I'm like kinda experienced in platformers in general, region one was fine, region two was okay, but region three was sometimes completely bullshit. <laughs> like in the last region, I completely did not care at all about just collecting the chest. I lost myself in this, I think, Snow Galar already. But the other regions w was fine. Like, I was paying attention and stuff like that. But, like, the first region was the perfect example that you can do 100% of this run, but the game is not letting you easily doing that. Especially with camera. We have this snap turn, but the snap turn is not something that completely solves the issue. Free movement is the way to just have freedom. So, those two main concerns for me, if we're gonna see the quest port eventually, I would love to be developed up until that moment. I was interested in storyline as well, but the storyline was not so in the face that from the tutorial and the first stage it seemed like it's going somewhere, but I still have no idea what's about with Nelson, what's about with just conflict. It was explained like in the main menu kinda that there was some invasion of some sort over the course of just regions and just levels. I didn't feel like I discovered what was going on really, so the storyline is kinda meh as well. There is some, but it's not cohesive in terms of just level progression. Overall, Ven is fun, but there is so much potential in just mechanics and just gameplay dynamic that I want this game to be more complex because it could be. But yeah, we'll have to see how it's gonna go with the quest port. I think it's gonna be an excellent title for quest because just of the movement of the head and just freedom and we don't have anything like that on the standalone. So I'm eagerly waiting for that moment to happen. <laughs>